Hey there, I'm Slightly Froggy. Welcome back to my stream. Today I'm continuing my playthrough of Mass Effect 2. And where we last left off, we got a prototype Krogan named Grunt. And we also got Jack as well. So we've got two new teammates who we're taking with us now to fight off some creators that have taken over one of the colonies. And Ashley's there. Might have to do a bit of a rescue with her. Hey there, Aqua. Welcome back to the stream. I hope you're doing well tonight. Also, we got a message earlier from the game. Welcome back to the stream. We're starting a couple of minutes later tonight. I got kind of held up. We were uh, cleaning up after dinner and I kind of lost track of time a little bit there. Uh, before we get into too much chatter, I want to give a shout out to Jurors for the follow. Gave us a follow between last week or last stream and tonight. Thank you so much for the follow, Jurors. Very much appreciate it. Thank you. It's it's one of those usernames that has like a lot of like X's in it, and I it's always that hesitation of like, do you read the X's? It's like Hunter Hunter. It's like, do you say Hunter X Hunter or do you say Hunter? Is it Spy X Family or is it Spy Family? I don't know, my, my anime brain always kind of has to hesitate a little bit on that. So we'll give people a couple minutes to kind of file in before uh, we kind of kick things off because we're just hitting the ground running. We're, we got some creators, we've got some gross bugs everywhere, we gotta save Ashley, we're gonna get to see what Jack can do because I didn't get to talk to her before this mission set off. It happens. Hey there, Texas. Welcome back to the stream. No, you're not the first tonight. It's Quan in the game got here first, but you were very, very close. You're third. It was like back in the day when it was just like first for comments. Hey there, Sean. Welcome back to the stream. I hope you're doing well tonight. I'm excited to see uh, facing the creators now. It's I've seen them on video, but I haven't faced them just yet. So we'll see how it is. Good yeah, that's good. Uh, actually, I got one of my finals done today, so I am thrilled. It was a presentation. It seemed to go well. So that's one down and six or seven to go. <laughs> but at least that's one down. I'll take that victory. I've got a, actually, I've got another one tomorrow. Yeah, it's a uh, presentation based schoolwork and it's group projects too. Which, uh, it's the double whammy of just, like, that one-two punch of projects you don't want. I don't know. I'll take papers and reports over that. Mind you, I still prefer those over exams. Exams, I would say, are probably, like, my least favorite. I'm, I have terrible memory, so that's, it, it is not my strong suit going into exams memorization based exams are just like the bane of my existence and i'm glad that i've for the most part left that behind like i've moved past it but group work that's also presentation based has its own challenges some groups are better than others but hopefully you're all doing well where you are Trying to think of a good, I haven't really gotten up to too much since the last stream. I've been playing a lot more Pokemon Scarlet. I had some time today, this afternoon, once I was done classes and my and my big finals. I was just like, I'm gonna treat myself. I'm gonna sit down on the couch. I'm gonna play some Pokemon Scarlet. And uh, looking forward to seeing Ashley again. You know what? Yeah. Like I I know in my playthrough of Mass Effect One for jokes and funsies like I made fun of Ashley quite a bit but like Ashley did get better Ashley is a very strong member of the team for sure and I'm hoping we'll get her to join our cause but given that she's doing sort of more like I know they've said that for the Alliance, it's almost like, oh yeah, like it's it's sort of like, almost like ambassadorship almost with some of the colonies. Uh, I don't buy that because I feel like if that were the case, Anderson would have told us that. So I don't know what Ashley's actually doing there. I don't know if it was meant to be sort of like luring out the creators because the Alliance is also following up on it. I'll be curious to see. I'm hoping Ashley will have some answers for us. But in any case, it is good to see Ashley again. And I've I've got my uh, my hot-headed new squad mates with me, so we're gonna get to see what they can do. Creators, you mean collectors? Oh shoot, did I say creators? I meant collectors. Oh shoot, brain fart, guys. Sorry. 
That was what I meant. Yeah, unfortunately, it's uh, it's finals brain. So occasionally, I've been I've been making little little slip ups here and there, and I felt like in the last stream, I was my navigation skills were worse than usual. So I don't know, maybe that's just me being a little hard on myself. Entirely possible, but it is seven thirty, so it's time for us to find out what the collectors are up to. Ooh. Had my headphone volume turned way, way up. <laughs> Don't want to give myself a heart attack here. Alright. So we've got our biotics. We've got our guns. I've got some biotics. I've got some guns. Okay. So. Jack, Grunt, we're good to go. Okay. Just Ooh, codex updated. We're ground side. Morden, you sure those armor upgrades will protect us from the Seeker Swarms? Certainty impossible, but in limited numbers should confuse detection make us invisible to swarms. In theory. Oh, great. Experimental I don't wanna... technology only test is contact with Seeker Swarms. Look forward to seeing if you survive. <laughs> Thanks, Morden. Much appreciated. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead there. Oh. Oh, jeez. Ooh, ooh, they fly. Hey there, Olaf. Welcome back to the stream. I hope you're doing well tonight. Um, don't like this. Not at all. It's, it's flyers. Alright, what can we do here? Ooh. Hey there, Architect. Welcome back to the stream. Hope you're doing well. Ooh, what are they firing? Okay, what can we do here? Well, we got him, but I can't see him. Collector Assassin. Oh, come out. I'll kill you all. Nice! Get him, Jack! Just run straight that- I know, I was like, is that just me or is he just running right at them? Uh. Ooh, hello. One more. It is just one more. Yeah! Right on your ass! Nice! Yes, we're fighting the collectors tonight. Just run in, fight, kill. Uh, looking for ammo, though. Ooh, hello. That's the good stuff. Here, hold on. I just want to get my, uh, that back. Anything else? Do you find the next upgrade? Tax collectors. <laughs> That's the real threat. Um, actually, before we go too far, I just want to make sure I'm not missing out on anything. Nope, nothing here. Eh, I had a feeling, but thought I should check. Never know what the collectors leave lying around. Jeez, what is this area? It's massive. Yeah, it's way the other way. Power cells, let's get those. Ooh, data pad. Let's hack it. Okay, so we got a bit of green, bit of purple, bit of green. Okay. Green, bit of purple, bit of green. Okay, white chunk with. There we go. Freedom's progress. Oh, <laughs> there we go. Six thousand credits. Don't mind if I do. What are we working with here? 
Ooh. Mm. Okay. All right. Uh, we're good. We're good. Morden, we're good. <laughs> Uh, Collectors must be blocking. We're on our own now. Of course. Oh boy. Ooh, ooh, what is that? Holy crap, what is that? Ooh, okay. It's about to get fun. Nothing can stop me! <laughs> All right, I just wanted to let her finish saying her bit there. Uh, let's go with that. Ooh. Burn and die. Ooh. I'll kill you all. Nice, thank you, Jack. Thank you. <laughs> What is what? There's a lot happening right now. <laughs> nice. Okay. Yeah, right on your ass. Okay, we're good. All right. Uh, Those yeah. things look like the husks that Geth used on Eden Prime. Didn't that get? Jack and Grunt, yes. My uh, right. latest team members. Must work for the there. Reapers. Just making sure I'm not forgetting anything. Nope. Okay. Yeah, I only just got them in the last stream. So I figured, eh, it's a good opportunity to test out, see what they can do. We got more data paths. Let's see. I feel bad, like I'm stealing from people. Careful with Jack, she's not the badass. She shows in her debut appearance, she dies easily. Oh, does she? Oh, okay. It's like, oh yeah, she's like a big biotic user. It's like, oh, let's give that a try. She has really great biotics, okay. I mean, she saved me now a couple of times. But I'll keep that in mind, that she's a, a little squishy. Which, I mean, like, looking at her armor, that makes sense, I guess. Hire him, then put him right to work. That's how it goes, right? I'll take it! Ooh, heavy skin weave. Let's give that a save. Alright, this way. Ah, uh, yeah. Through there. Oh, boy. They're just gonna be shooting through here. Ooh! Dead husk. Sort of looks human. This one of the colonists? No. On Eden Prime, victims were impaled on giant spikes to turn them into husks. I haven't seen any on Horizon. So I'm the collectors sure. had the husks I have the chance and to talk took to the yet. colonists alive for something else. Hmm. Living victims, that's grim. These husks look different. Wasting time here. Uh... These aren't the same creatures I fought on Eden Prime. They're more advanced. Evolved. They've evolved. They still die when you shoot them. Eventually. <laughs> Collectors must be experimenting on the colonists. What are they up to? Uh -oh. Sounds almost worse than what Cerberus did to me. Guess we'll find out when we stop them. Alright, let's go save the colonists. Collectors aren't getting away with more victims. Let's move out. Whatever you say, boss lady. That's me, the boss lady. What the heck? Peaceful. Yeah. Oh, they're coming in though. A lot of chemicals for me to get this kind of coin. <laughs> Where are they coming from? Or are we coming to them? Oh, there they are. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't have to be intelligent. It's fine. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> okay, okay. Okay, I'll get the rest to move. Uh, what can we 
do here. Here we go. We're good. We're good. Okay, what do we got? We still got two in the front there. What can we do? Pull, pull. I'll throw you like a toy! You get him? No, we still got one more. Where are they? Like, way up ahead? They're up there. Are they stuck? Hold up, hold up. Whoop, there they are. Oh, nice. Alright, let's take a look, see what we got around here. Lovely little vantage spot. Ooh, a safe. I I know this is a victim safe, but I mean, if they don't need it, I'll I'll take it. Okay, we got pins. Got the press. Oh, crud. They are creepy looking. Ooh, I didn't save first. Ah. Uh. Ooh, that was that was a one try. Dang. Okay. Note to self: make sure I save before that. I know. Normally, I'm better. I'll get him next time. I mean, do I need more credits? Maybe. <laughs> Never tell you when you only get one shot. I know. I like to keep you guessing. Anything over here? Ooh. Anything? Nope. Okay. Actually, hold up. Got some in here. Nope. Just some ammo that I don't need. Some gross sleeping bags. Stasis Park. What is it? Stasis Field? Leaves them helpless but aware. They've been like this a long time. Okay. Ooh, collector particle beam acquired. Falling squad members are now able to use this weapon. All right. Collector particle beam. Interesting. Cool gun. It is a cool gun. Hey, who are you? Who are you? Oh, no, you're frozen. Okay. Okay. So should I be saving this for a particular thing? Or should I switch back to my pistol? Because I don't know. Well, I guess I can test it out. Let's test it out. <laughs> okay. Okay. Here, I'm gonna give that a save. Hey there, Commander Shepard here. Welcome to the stream. Hope you're doing well tonight. I'm doing well. I got to finish uh, one of my finals today, so uh, feeling pretty good. So here, I'm gonna I'm gonna switch my pistol for now. I can always change it up. Cause I nope. Yeah, we're gonna get into something now. Switch back. 
Damn it. I've lost shield. Ah. Ah. This is ah. Okay, heal, 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 heal. Uh folks. Can you can you help me out here just a little bit? many more we got here. Okay, I gotta get up. Nope, get up, please. Yeah, right on your ass! Ah! Ooh, it just cuts through them like butter. Alright, we got one more left. Ah! Alright, and we're good. This is, this is pretty awesome. <laughs> Alright. Um, would like to have more ammo, though. Man. They're stingy on the ammo here. I don't know, I'm used to it being littered literally everywhere. Oh, nope, we're full. Okay, doesn't matter. Wait, is there anything over this way? What else we got? Ooh. I'll take that. What else we got here? Yeah. Yeah, it's, I know it's over that way. But, like, there might be stuff up here. Or not. <laughs> New weapons use different ammo. They want you to be more strategic with them. Okay, that's, that's understandable. Then I'll switch back to the pistol, which is a bit easier to maneuver with. Alright. What's over this way? Okay. Ooh. Heavy weapons ammo. There we go. Look at that. There are N7 Man of Kent. Welcome back to the stream. I hope you're doing well. Alright. What are we working with here? Yeah, just one last one because I don't want to have to do all that running if I die. Ooh. Okay. And also potentially for this too because I already failed one tonight. Had work today, now I have two days off. Congratulations, enjoy your time off. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just save that. Oh, here we go. Who's there? Company. Get out Is it here, Ashley? now. Is it Ashley? Oh, you're not Ashley. You're... You're human. What are you doing out here? You lead them right here. You had to hear them trying to get in. Seems like it's hard to hide from the collectors. Those things are collectors? You mean, they're real? I thought they were just made up, you know, propaganda to keep us in Alliance space. No, oh, they got Lilith. I, I saw her go down. Sten, too. They, they got damn near everybody. What's your name? What do you do here? Name's Delan. Mechanic. I came down to check Sounds on the main like grid after we lost our comm signals. And I heard screaming. I looked outside and there were swarms of bugs. Everyone they touched just froze. I, I, I sealed the doors. Damn it, it, it's the Alliance's fault. They stationed that Chief Williams here and built those defense towers. It made us a target. Yeah, I don't know about that. Yeah, tell me about Ashley. Tell me more about this Alliance rep. Chief Williams? Heard she was some kind of hero or something. Didn't mean nothing to me, though. Would rather she just stayed back in council space. Any idea what she was doing on Horizon? Supposed to be helping us get the defense towers up and running. I got the feeling she was here for something else. Spying on us, maybe. 
I had that theory. It's just like there's a reason Anderson couldn't tell us. If she was just checking out the, the different colonies, mm, he would have told us. Tell me about the colony defense towers. A gift from the Alliance. High-powered Guardian lasers. Supposed to keep hostile ships from landing near the colony. Well... Had to build a massive underground generator just to give it enough juice. Only we couldn't get the targeting systems online. So the Alliance gave us a giant gun that couldn't shoot straight. Stupid sons of bitches. <laughs> Bureaucracy at its finest. Why do you think this is the Alliance's fault? We're just a small colony. Nobody bothered us before we started building those damn defense towers and drew attention to ourselves. I left Council Space to get away from the Alliance. Nothing good ever comes from getting mixed up with them. Ah, uh, ooh. <laughs> the Collectors are targeting remote colonies. The Alliance was trying to help. I don't need their help. Too many strings attached. That rep said she was just here to get the towers on mine, but mark my words, there's more to it. I mean, he's probably right, but <laughs> he's right about that one. If you have defenses, we can use them against the collector ship. You'd need to calibrate the targeting system first. It's never worked right. We can figure it out. Just give us the location. Head for the main transmitter on the other side of the colony. Pretty hard to miss. The targeting controls are at the base. <laughs> it's like, I'm sure we'll figure it out. It's just like, I brought the two people with me who are, uh... Much I don't know Jack's qualifications. She could be a genius at this stuff, and I don't know. I've only just met her, but uh, probably pretty safe to say Grunt has no idea. Yeah, let's see if we can get this guy to help. You know this colony and the equipment. You better come with us. Not a chance in hell. I don't think so. You'd probably just get in the way. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. Coward. I'll let you out, but I'm locking the door behind you. I'm not taking any chances. Good luck. I think you're gonna need it. Thanks for your help. Thanks for nothing. Alright. Let me just save before I accidentally screw this one up. <laughs> Two Paragon points. Okay, got a Metagel. Nice. Here, wait, one more. Yeah, oh wait. I, I forgot to last time and it's the first time in a long time where I've screwed up one of these. Oh, never mind. <laughs> never mind. <laughs> They're like, here's a gimme. All right, thanks. Uh, anything else? Ooh, I'll take that platinum. I'm not leaving this bunker until those aliens are gone. All right, let's see how we do here. All right. Oop, this looks like a prime shooting spot. Ooh, hello. Got a got a couple of ya. All right, where's where's my gang? Where's my gang here? Oh, trouble! All right, let's see what we can do. Intervention is necessary. Ooh, he's coming back. All right. I'll put them down. We are your genetic destiny. Ooh. All right, we're getting we're getting fired on here. You cannot reach. <laughs> Switch back before I use up all my ammo here. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, it's just the one. What the hell is that? Okay, um. No shields! Ooh, yeah, you weren't kidding. <laughs> okay. Ooh. I'm not messing with that one. 
Alright. Let's, uh, let's collect. <laughs> let's collect from the collectors. There we go. Yep, still at 210. Okay. Alright. Here we go. Let's see if maybe the game will gift me with some more. I'm not gonna get my hopes up, but we'll see. No. Explosives. That's not the big one, that's just a medium size, it doesn't even fly. Oh no, they fly? Why do they fly? Why would they do this? Oop. Thank you. It's just, uh, no. I don't, I don't like the idea that they fly. Don't like it. Not in the, not in the slightest. I know, I know, but, yeah, okay, we're going the right way. Ooh. Yeah, we can use this. Biotic damage. Right. Why don't we don't see more frozen people around? Probably loaded onto the collector ship by now. We go good luck. Oh no! What do you mean? No! What do you mean good luck? <laughs> what are we in for here? Oh, I mean, don't tell me. But okay, I I appreciate the the semi warning. Any? No, nope, we're good. Okay. Um, wait. Did I look up here? I don't think I did. Just like they're taking Ashley away right now. It's like I know, but I'm looking for stuff. Just building the tension. <laughs> I mean, it's working. It's working. I'll just say good luck, even if there's nothing. <laughs> there we go. All right, let's give it a save before we. Uh... Nope. Can't? Okay, that's all right. All right. Let's see how we do here. Circle. Press. There we go. I don't like this. Uh, alright. Oh, there we go. Alright, what are we- there's... Oh, nice. Oh, we got a bunch. We do about these guys. <laughs> okay, survive. I'll try. Um, oh, we got some more coming over that way. Really? Grunt. Alright, uh, alright, nobody's got it. Oh, crap. Oh, is he down again? Jeez, Grunt. Alright, uh. 
Oh, and... Oh, grunt! Alright. Now, nah, let's try it again. We got Here's here. The transmitter. Okay, fantastic. Can I can I get some more ammo, please? I need some, please. There we go. That's the good stuff. All right, let's. Ooh. All right, let's save here just in case things go sideways. Course. Okay, so we got some green, a bit of orange, a bit of blue. Alright. Big chunk of white. Alright. That one! <laughs> I don't believe you. Normandy. You I copy? want to, but Joker I don't here. believe you. Signal's weak, Commander, but we got you. Alright. Edie, can you get the colony's defense towers online? Errors in the calibration software are easily rectified, but it will take time to bring the towers to full power. We don't I have recommend time. a defensive posture. I will not be able to mask the increased generator output. The collectors will try to stop it. Good. Got any other helpful tips? Just one. Enemy reinforcements are closing in. I suggest you ready weapons. <sighs> All right. Um, I don't know where they're coming from. I'm assuming that direction. We are the harbinger of your destiny. Ah, hello. A block shields. Okay, what can we do here? Impact shot. <laughs> There's a lot going on here. Okay. This hurts you. Okay, I shouldn't be wasting that. Nothing can stop me. Okay, we got that one. The dead are useless. All right. Bypassing fail safes and attempting emergency power up. Please hold the defense tower. Ooh, what is that? Ooh. Okay, we got problems here. Okay. Two there, we got him over there. He's recharging. I'll destroy you. Okay, he's still there. He's still over there. Okay, got him. There will be more. There's always more. Always more. All right, let's swap back then. 250. Okay, that's not bad. Shot. Sequential power up initiated. Guardian anti ship batteries at 40%. More coming. Guess we got their attention. I can 
take you off. All right. do here to tear you apart Shepard. all right i'm just making sure i've got my team here I will. okay everything's on cool now if i must tear you apart Shepard, i will ah, bitch nice Still got three. We're not doing too bad. Here, I'm just taking a quick breather. Okay. <laughs> I mean, I don't know what she's capable of. She's brand- Oh, sorry if I meant Jack. <laughs> That's true. I did bring a baby Krogan to this fight, but supposedly he's the best of the best. Wait. Just one left. <laughs> I don't know, for some reason my brain went Jack. Yeah, right on your ass. Alright, and one more. You're swing control. Oh, really? We are hard. Your form is fragile. Whoop, where are you going? Up top. Okay. Gotta be more soon. No, of course. It's true, he has he has died a lot. I've only got two more unities left. Oh, okay. Good luck now. Oh no, don't say that! <laughs> oh no, that's what that's for. Okay. Alright. I'm just gonna fire it. Easy, we need that system online. Don't know what that is, but keep back. My attack didn't work. Yeah, right on your ass! I'm out. <laughs> I'm out. Taking heavy fire. Anti-ship batteries and collector vessel. Yep, I I used up everything. Oh. Maybe? Oh, I do. Ah! Oh, oh crap. Back up. I feel like I'm not making any progress with this. Um, concussive shots. Try those. Yeah, right on your ass. Did I 
do it. <gasps> we did it. Okay. Okay. Need ammo. Need ammo. <laughs> All right. Thing was terrifying. <laughs> no! Don't let him get away! There's nothing we can do. They're gone. Half the colony's in there. They took Egan and Sam and, and Lilith. Do something! I didn't want it to end this way. I did what I could. It was a good fight, Shepard. See? Shepard. Wait. I know that name. I know. Sure, that. I remember you. You're some type of big alliance hero. Some Commander Shepard, captain of the Normandy, the first human specter, savior of the Citadel. Aww. You're in the presence of a god, Delan, back from the dead. Oh, the oh, good no people worries. we lost and you get left behind. It's worth Figures. it for Turkey. Screw this. I'm done with you alliance types. <laughs> Takes all kinds. I thought you were dead, Commander. We all did. It's good to see you, Ashley. And welcome back to the stream, Gen X Dad Gaming. It's been too long, Ash. How have you been? That's it? You show up after two years and act like nothing's happened? I, I would have followed years. you anywhere, Commander. I thought you were gone. I... You were more than our Commander. Why didn't you try to contact me? Why didn't you let me know you were alive? I mean, that was... I wasn't even conscious. I have important things to do. Ouch. Uh, you know, just time. I was out for two years. You've moved on with your career and your life. Why reopen old wounds? I moved on. But here you are, pulling me back in. <laughs> and now we've got reports about you and Cerberus. Reports? Wow, you guys are slipping. Alliance Intel said Cerberus could be behind our missing colonies. We got a tip that this one could be the next to get hit. I went to Anderson, but he wouldn't talk. But there were rumors that you weren't dead. Worse, that you were working for the enemy. Uh, I mean, I guess, but I guess I should say this one. That feels like the Paragon answer. Our colonies are disappearing. The Alliance turned its back on them. Cerberus is the only group willing to do something about it. Bullshit. I know what Cerberus is like. They talk about putting humans first, but at what cost? I wanted to believe that you were alive. I just never expected anything like this. You've turned your back on everything we stood for. What, Ashley? Ash, you know me. You know I'd only do this for the right reason. She's you very saw it yourself. Bad. Big the collectors are targeting human colonies, and they're working with the Reapers. I'd like to believe you, Shepard, but I don't trust Cerberus. And it worries me that you do. What did they do to you? What if they're Probably behind back from the dead? What if they're the ones working with the collectors? I hate these guys too, but they're not the only threat out there. And I mean, like, Jack really hates Cerberus. I don't even know all the details yet, but she's made it very clear she hates Cerberus. So she's telling you it's not them. I'd be inclined to believe her. <laughs> yeah, it's coming from Jack. I know. Ash doesn't know. And admittedly, me, I don't know. Shepard apparently does. You're letting how you feel about oh, I shouldn't have said get too in emotional. the way of the facts. Or maybe you feel like you owe Cerberus because they saved you. Maybe it's you doesn't matter. I still know where my loyalties lie. I'm an Alliance soldier. It's in my blood. Okay. That's fine. I'm reporting back to the Citadel. I'll let them decide if they believe your story. Ooh. I mean, I'll ask her, but I don't think she will. I could use someone like you and my crew, Ash. It'll be just like old times. No, it won't. I'm no fan of aliens, but Cerberus has a history of being extremist. I'll never work for a group like that. So long, Commander. Good I've, luck. I've got an alien right here. Ashley, no. Yep. Joker, 
Send the shuttle to pick Here us I up. Here I thought I was going to get shot down by the collectors. Me. Got shot down by Ashley. I know, that's, uh... I mean... <laughs> I don't blame her, but... I mean, they brought me back from the dead. I guess I owe them something. And also, the collectors are targeting humans, so... I mean, if anything, I would say this proves to the Alliance that Cerberus are not the ones behind this. That it's the Collectors, and that there's a threat here. Collectors escaped with approximately one-third of Horizon's population. Front Corporation will funnel supplies, monetary aid to colony survivors. <laughs> when they're telling you, you know there's a problem. Seems hard if you romance her as male ship. Ooh, I can imagine, yeah. Oh, that would sting. Mind you, I was going to say, I still haven't seen Liara yet. I know she's working for the Shadow Broker, so we'll see how that goes. All right, Front Corporation Funnel Supplies, Monetary Aid to Colonial Survivors. Collector Leader Harbinger demonstrates a personal interest in Shepard. Unclear whether his ability to possess his minions is cybernetic override, indication of hive mind among collectors, or even reaper technology at work. Savage teams captured collector bodies for study. Okay, so that could, that could maybe get us somewhere. If you bring Garrish, he's disappointed he's going along with it too. Oh no, I couldn't do that to him. I don't know if they particularly got along when we were all on the Normandy together, but I, I wouldn't want to put Garrus in that situation. Well, I thought that was what they mentioned. And anyway, it, it was mentioned in broad terms at the beginning. I could be misremembering it. The situation could be a bit more complicated than that. We will see. <laughs> all right, new heavy weapon, biotic damage. Bio amp upgrade, squad bonus, plus 10 to biotic damage, heavy skin weave, plus 10 health, nice, got some credits, got some platinum. Colony defense. Shepard, good work on Horizon. Hopefully the collectors will think twice before attacking another colony. It's not a victory. We interrupted the Collectors, but they still abducted half the colony. That's better than an entire colony, and more than we've accomplished since the abductions began. The Collectors will be more careful now, but I think we can find another way to lure them in. Hmm. Ash said the Alliance got a tip about me and Cerberus. Was that you? Maybe. I may have let it slip that you were alive, <laughs> and with Cerberus. You risked the lives of my friend, my crew, and that entire colony just to lure the Collectors there? A calculated risk. I suspected the Collectors were looking for you or people connected to you. Now I know for certain. I told you I wouldn't sit and wait while the Reapers and Collectors gather strength. Besides, they would have hit another colony eventually, and without a way to predict which one, they would have abducted everyone. I mean, I get it. But it's still, it's still very morally gray. We have to make sure they don't abduct anyone else. I want the Collectors stopped for that very reason. That's why we're doing this, Shepard. I'm devoting all resources to finding a way through the Omega-4 relay. We have to hit them where they live. Your team will need to be strong, as will their resolve. There's no looking back. The same goes for you. Can I assume you put your past relationships behind you? Maybe. <laughs> uh, that's off the limits. None of your damn business. If it affects the mission, better you should leave it behind. Shepard, once you find a way through the Omega-4 relay to the Collector homeworld, there's no guarantee you'll return. To have any hope of surviving, you and your entire team must be fully committed to this. Let me worry about them. You just find us a way to the Collector homeworld. I just want to be upfront about your odds. You'll need everyone at their best. I've forwarded three more dossiers. Keep building your team while I find a way through the relay. And be careful, Shepard. The Collectors will be watching you. I mean... Here, I've, I've got a... Th I don't want to say a theory. I want to throw something out there, but I'm I guess we're wait. really going to do it. Hit the Omega-4 relay. 
take the fight to the collectors in person. Looking forward to the action. After seeing what those bastards did on Horizon, though, makes you think. They're powerful, but we've got a few tricks for them. If anyone can stop them, we can. No argument there, Commander. Horizon just made it hit home. What we're doing, what we're up against. Gonna go take care of a little unfinished business. I imagine everyone else is, too. Getting some closure, you know? Sure. <laughs> so just on the, um, that comment there about the elusive man being trustworthy. I mean... So, nobody confirm nor deny this. This is just me theorizing, throwing it out there. He has zero problem with putting people at risk if it potentially leads to action being taken in the right direction. So my theory is he's gonna purposefully put us in the Normandy, and especially getting the word out that Shepard's on the ship, as soon as it's like having major problems with the Collectors and the Reapers, we go through the relay, like potentially Shepard even dying could be the thing that unites the Alliance and potentially even Cerberus. I don't know. I'm just throwing it out there. Nobody confirm nor deny this. This is just something I'm throwing out there that potentially he's leading us into a purpose, an on-purpose death trap. I think his eyes are creepy. They are. I agree. <laughs> All right, I'm taking no more, no more calls from him until I feed my fish. Yes, like I said, I'm just throwing it out there. I could, could be, I could be totally wrong. I'll talk to Kelly in a minute. I have to go feed the fish. First priority, fish. Fish can't wait. They will starve and they will die. There we go. Happy fish. The elusive man is my dad. <laughs> Aw, little hammy. Joker forgot him after Jack's mission. Yeah. I was, I don't know, just because, like, Joker didn't really have too much to say in Mass Effect 1, so it's kind of like a habit I'm having to get into that I should talk to Joker. Jacob was referring to the loyalty system in the game. Okay. Because I know it's like everybody gets their own little loyalty mission. Because, yeah, some of the skills are locked behind those. So I should probably get to work on some of those. I have Z's. Hey, Commander. It's uh, pretty crazy the people you can run into out here, huh? I mean, it was probably a setup or something, but it was still good to see Ash, Operations Chief Williams, wasn't it? She moved on. I can't blame her. She was frontline with you blowing up half the Citadel, and I'm the one who gets roped back into saving the galaxy? <laughs> Did somebody switch our files? You're the force that pulls it all together, Joker. Yeah, it sucks. I'll give you that. <laughs> I assume everything's going well up here? Shh. Joker? I can tell when it's listening. I am always listening, Mr. Moreau. I know. <laughs> They're cute. I'm sorry. I, lo I love it. I love it. It's cute. <laughs> That's it for now. See you, Commander. Shh, she's listening. I'm always listening. <laughs> they are the dream team. Just hung around the cockpit. Oh, not really, no. I know there's sometimes a bit of chatter. Here, let's check it out while we're here. Got some pressure loss in the number four hydrogen tank. Lock it down, Edie. Edie? Oh, I'm sorry. Now you don't want me to listen. You know what I hate about deep space? Crap radio stations from two centuries back. My gosh, we were idiots. <laughs> hey. Hey now. I take personal offense to that one. Sports team, huh? <laughs> Go sports. <laughs> All right. 
Uh, let's go see what Kelly's up to. Oh, he's wonderful. Excellent banter with Edie. I saw the reports on Horizon, Commander. What you did was amazing. The report mentioned that Ashley Williams was there. How did that go? <laughs> it's, uh, those are three. Hmm. 1983 film attacked. <laughs> hey, radio's gone through an evolution over the decades. Uh, blame people in the future will view art. Oh, for sure, yeah. That's the thing. It's like uh, social norms and expectations and all that are going to change a lot. Like, they've already changed a lot in my lifetime. I'm only like 31 years old. Uh, let's see. It went well. Fine. Or, I miss her. Uh, ooh, what answer do I want to go with here? Let's go with fine. There's not much to say. The past is the past. I understand. Anyway, how may I help you, Commander? Is there anything I should know? You have unread messages at your private terminal. Operative Lawson would like to see you at her station on the crew deck. Operative Taylor would like to see you over in the armory. Anything else, Commander? Mm. Do you have a moment to talk? I always have time for you, Commander. Nope, I should just stop I better looking. Go. Okay. <laughs> she never Maybe has anything to add. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. <laughs> I know, you just told me. <laughs> I know. <laughs> but I'm not going to look at the terminal messages until I'm done talking to everybody because that's how I got roped into that last mission. Well, actually, no, I guess it wasn't the terminal. It was the conferencing room. I should have known better. Hey, Commander, buddy. Sorry, I'm a little unfocused. Personal matter. It won't affect my duties. I had a, had a little, little, little something right there. Uh, you'll have to know what chambers. The yeoman said you wanted to see me. What's this about, Jacob? As I said, it's a personal matter. I don't want to waste our time if it turns out to be a goose chase. But... Well, I got pinged by a ghost the other night. Family. I'm listening. My private log got an update about the Hugo Gerns back, the ship my father served on. It sent an SOS last week, reporting a crash and requesting a rescue. Shepard, that ship went missing ten years ago. Hey there, Kay. Welcome back to my father for three years before that. I buried everything but a body. Now, I'm not convinced it isn't just some automated distress signal ticking over. It's been too long. Hugo Awards fame. I'd think you'd be more excited that your yep. father might be Another alive. daddy issue. He wasn't around enough for me to have bad memories. It's an old, well-healed wound. But if he's actually alive and needs help, I also want to note that it's not normal procedure for distress calls to be routed to the Normandy. This was passed to my personal log through Cerberus filters. Any signs that this is a Cerberus front? Who passed this to you? I doubt the elusive man would let a direct operation stake hold this long. If there's a link, it's probably just about money. Cerberus needs diverse holdings to fund projects like, well, you. I was expensive. And whoever sent this my way covered their tracks. Someone could be fishing for favors, or thought it would get under my skin. Who knows with that bunch. You didn't get along with your father? He made no apologies, I'll give him that. You make a mistake, you own up to it. Even if you keep making it. Whatever problems we had were a lifetime ago. I've had ten years to get to where I am. And as far as I know, he's still a ghost. Tell me about the Hugo Gernsback and what it was doing. Privately held frigate. I looked over the mission brief when it disappeared. Nothing stood out. Typical research and grab operation. Find an uncharted planet, stake a claim, and establish as large a presence as you can as fast as possible to shut out competitors. Okay. Interesting. I think we can spare the time. Pass the coordinates to Joker. I appreciate that, Commander. I don't expect more than dusty old bones, but it'll be good to close the record. Sweet. Does that mean... Okay, we're not doing it right now. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Pass like, on the coordinates to Joker. I'm like, we're not going now, are we? 
I mean, I want to help Jacob, absolutely, but... Maybe, maybe not right now. <laughs> Let's see, what else can we get here? Ooh, we can up our shotgun damage. Ooh, we can get that. Alright. Oh, okay, can <laughs> No. <laughs> well, I mean, there's no mommy issues. Let's see. Tech duration. Shield upgrade. Shield upgrade would be nice. Uh, we got enough. I feel like I'm always losing shields. Uh, bionic damage of 500? Oh, pff, that costs like nothing. And tech duration. Oh, 3,000 of 4,000. Oh my goodness. Omni tool upgrade. Uh, your performance that you did an individual task. I mean, I did just, I did spend a lot of resources getting like a custom Omni tool for Morden. So, you know, let's go for it. Why not? Why not? Let's, you only live once. What else do we got here? Ship enhancements. Uh, not enough platinum. Prototypes. Salt armor. Collectors. Snoop. No, I don't want that. Uh, heavy skin weave. We do have enough palladium. Here we go. I need to talk to everybody first to see what missions we have at our disposal. And then we will decide. Let's see. Nope. Don't want that. Uh, new heavy weapon. Missile launcher. Hmm. Kind of cool. Mass Effect 1, the R and the Rack Knight. That is very true. Uh, Morden, do you have any uh, parent issues that I need to be aware of? Shepard, how can I help? Have you got a minute to talk? Not at moment. Think I've unlocked collector interest in humans. Wait, no. Only one heart. Krogan have two. Scratch that. Anything else? <laughs> uh, Any ideas on other ways to prepare for the collectors? Oh no, this just Sorry, reroutes I've me done what place. I can. Focusing on studying collector tech now. Are there any medical concerns I should be aware of on the team? Cerberus personnel in excellent condition. No squad concerns to report. Always some matters, but nothing affecting immediate mission. Hmm. Is the lab working well for you? Quite satisfactory. Found a few surveillance bugs. Uh. Just need more samples. More collector data, tissue samples, anything you can get, I can use. Find new tech. I'm working on it. All right. I'll let you work. We'll be here if you need me. Oh, Morden. All right. Let's go to the next deck. Go talk to Miranda. See what she wants to talk about. Probably her dad, because it seems like we're now starting to get all the uh, personal affairs out in the open. And actually, I don't know if I talked to Miranda last time I was in. Here, I'll give that a quick save in case I say something I regret. Shepard, I find myself in the unpleasant position of asking for your help. I don't like discussing what? personal matters, but this is important. Miranda, you're one of my crew. Tell me what's on your mind. You remember what I told you about father? Building a dynasty? There was another reason I went to Cerberus for protection. I have a sister, a twin, and he's still hunting her. Cerberus has kept her safe until now. Huh? She's living a normal life on Ilium, safe and hidden from my father. Interesting. I'm kind of surprised he only made two. So you think your father's tracked her down? Precisely, Commander. My sources indicate he knows that she's on Ilium. I've tried to keep her hidden without impacting her life, but I'm out of options. He's too close. I need to relocate my sister's family before it's too late. Oh, she has a family. What do you know about your sister? She's my genetic twin. We're identical, but she deserves a normal life and she's going to get it no matter what. Did your sister's family know about this? Are they okay with being relocated? They know nothing. They're completely uninvolved. Normal. 
I told Cerberus and they're coming up with a positive reason to move the family. I can help. What do you need me to do? Like Ilium. My father okay. is extremely persistent. I'd like to go to Ilium when Cerberus is moving the family to make sure none of his agents get too close. My contact's name is Lantea. She'll be waiting for us in the lounge near the Nos Astra docking bay. Okay, speak to Lantea. I haven't had a meal back there in a long time. I didn't think Rupert had it in him. <laughs> Still serving the good stuff. How Thanks can I help me. you, Commander? I won't take any more of your time. Back to work. <laughs> All right, let's see. Oh, I need to hunt down where Jack's hiding out, don't I? Hey, buddy. Shepard, need me for something? Have you got a minute? Yeah, I'll try. Can it wait for a bit? I'm in the middle of some calibrations. Dang, nothing to talk to Garrus talk about. Talk to you later, Garrus. Okay. I'll be here if you need me. All right. Let's save. After that riveting and uh, very decisive conversation we had there. Anything with Chakwas? Always calibrating. He's a busy guy. How may guy. I help you, Commander? Nothing. I'll see you later, Doctor. Commander. <laughs> Was good seeing you, I guess? Alright. Always check the crew's quarters, just in case. There's usually chatter. They are sitting in silence today. Drinks, shutters. Hey, Kasumi. There you are. Yes, here I am. There you are. Gabby and Ken would make a great couple. I just doubt they'll ever realize it. <laughs> the Normandy runs so quietly. I'm not used to hearing my footsteps when I walk. One of the girls in navigation thinks she might be pregnant. Even aboard a Cerberus vessel, life finds a way. Come back later. I'm sure I'll have more to talk about. <laughs> All right, good, good talk, Kasumi. All right, engineering. So I'm assuming she's in engineering. Ah, uh, here, wait. Let's go to the port cargo first, because I think this is Grunt's room. Yes, it is. Just standing in front of your tube. Shepard. What are your thoughts about our mission? I fight. Doesn't matter who for. Upgrades? Anything in your tank imprints that can make use of the resources we found? Hmm. Might have something I could put together. Don't know how useful it will be. Oh, okay. Nah. So I should keep this crap around? Don't let it pile up. I live down here. <laughs> I want to talk about you, Grant. It's like, I don't know. Guess I have dad issues. He's dead, but I don't care. Is that bad? I don't know. Shepard, help me figure this out. Just checking in. Making sure you're acclimatizing. The hold is too open. Not enough cover. Armor is limited. Warlord Grant would target here to scatter heavy cargo, then focus on engines. That's what tank imprints show about human ships anyway. It's how I learned from the tank. Old pictures where memory is. Like holding a book for a child. Just remember this picture after picture. No help with finding a reason to care. Hmm. Okay, what direction do we want to take this in? Uh... What other human info's floating around in there? Less than a finger deep to sever your spine. You're soft. Solarian, Sasari, all soft. Quarians, not so much. Turians, you have to work the blade, I guess. Don't see much point to it, though. <laughs> much point. <laughs> uh, never mind. Good joke, Grunt. <laughs> see, they made sure to program him with humor. The ability to recognize it. 
Yeah, I was curious about that as well when he mentioned the Quarians. I was just like, I was like, the suits? Because we don't, well, I don't know what Quarians look like underneath their suits. They could be heavily armored, hard to say. Something must move you. You're as genetically Krogan as you can get. I see suffering, the dead, and I think weak. I'm supposed to be strong. My guts were grown from thousands more worthy. The dead were weak. If they were strong, I wouldn't be needed. I don't know why Okir started teaching. When he turned on the tank the first time, I screamed. Weak. Pitiful. I mean, you are, in essence, a baby. Cut yourself some slack? <laughs> so you started small, but you became what you are. Not everyone gets that chance. I'm built for strength, but didn't earn it. I just am. Those dead were strong enough to try, even if they lost. The perfect Krogan, ignoring what made me. No strength in that. I'll take another look at what happened to the Krogan. Find a reason to care about it. That's inter- I don't know. I find Grunt's angle here very interesting. Just, he's not somebody who's weighed down by his past, but he's looking for a past to kind of weigh him down. It's interesting. Yeah. Yeah, actually, now that I think about it. Yeah. I wouldn't have thought that those two would be similar, but yeah, they they are very similar. Artificial beings, in essence. With no connection to their fatherly figures, trying to find their reason to keep going. In Grunt's case, it's like, uh, I guess trying to figure out like the honor of being a Krogan. And in Miranda's case, it's trying to put her abilities to productive use to help others. I suppose. Back for another lesson. Sure, tell me about your other rifles. Tough fight, yeah, on Horizon. Be interesting. I fought slavers and kidnapping rings, but nothing like that. Some slavers took a little girl on a colony in the Skepsis system. Girl woke up, fought her way out, got picked up by my band well on her way to Omega. Hmm. Eight years old. She'd have had no chance on Horizon. Oh. I will say, Tex, like, that is, like, nail on the head. Yeah, created to be perfect, but feeling only their inadequacies. Jack, subject zero, whatever you call her. Hell of a girl. Could have used a destructive little bitch like that ten years ago when we dropped blind into the Krogan DMZ. Took out a lot of Krogan that day, but we lost way too many men. I should let you go. Talk more later, Shepard. What? You don't want to spend two hours telling me about your other guns? Come on, Zaid. I'm your friend. There, what do we got going on back here? My engineering friends. put some friends. crazy tech into the main guns. It's almost doubled their power draw. But they seem pretty wicked. Indeed. Don't worry. A few tweaks to the forward capacitors, and the balance is back in line. Garrus has been hard at work. It's all those calibrations. Jesse. <laughs> Alright, so let me try going downstairs to see if I can find Jack. <laughs> Man, I get into drunken brawls with journalists. Hey, Jack. How you doing? Hey. What do you think of Miranda and Jacob? Jacob doesn't know who he is, but that's not my problem. Miranda's a Cerberus bitch. Knew that before she opened her mouth. <laughs> Tell me how you really feel. What do you think of our mission? I don't care. I'm out to survive it, then cut loose. <laughs> Jack's great. I love this. Tell me about you, Jack. What's I'm still finding out about me. Thanks for letting me look at these files. If they're helping you, that's good enough for me. Don't be my buddy. You need me to kill for you, I need you for these files. Let's leave it there. Your friends at Cerberus are into some nasty things. I'm gonna find something I can use. I just know it. Let's, let's dig into this a little bit. What if the answers aren't what you expect? I'm not looking for answers. 
I'm looking for names, dates, places. The people to visit? <laughs> what happens when you find what you're looking for? I go hunting. Anyone who's screwed with me pays. Their associates pay. Their friends pay. The galaxy is going to be a lot emptier when I'm done. I have to say, I'm... I hadn't thought about it, but I'm not surprised. It's just like they hate each other, but yet... Yeah, exactly. They want to bang. Um, I don't think I tell her what she can't do. What's your history with Cerberus? They raised me in a research facility. I escaped when I was a kid. Been on the run ever since. And they've been chasing me ever since. But soon, I'm gonna chase them. <laughs> I kind of want to ask both of these, but yeah, you sound excited. You think about this a lot, don't you? I go to sleep with this. I wake up with it. Everyone I kill, I pretend it's the ones that did this to me. You don't have to live in this pit, you know. It's dark, quiet, and hard to find. That spells safety to me. You know, this ship is a powerhouse. You could go pirate. Live like a queen. I could help. Is that a proposition? <laughs> Uh, see, I know exactly what's going I'm gonna say that and she'll be like, oh, stop being a goody two-shoes. Sound like Miranda. You know, mm, this could, this could lead to some fun banter. Let's go with this one. You'd be my first mate. Yeah. I'd lead the boarding party and handle the executions. You enjoy killing. Goodbye. What is it about killing that fascinates you so much? I figure every time someone dies and it's not me, my chances of survival go up. Simple. I should go. Yep. Ooh, plus two renegade. Okay, plus four paragon. It mostly evened out. It's fine. Just just a couple more uh just a couple more renegade points. Not a big deal. Okay. <laughs> I don't even have the right hat. Okay, so I think that's everybody. Alright, so now we have to decide. I'm just to scare the renegade points. That's normal. I know, no I know. Messages for you, Commander. I do have some at my terminal. Like, I just... I just know they add up. And while I don't mind picking up the odd renegade points here and there, I just want to make sure that they don't counteract the paragon ones. Because I am trying to be mostly paragon. So I'm just I'm just keeping an eye on my points there. Incoming message from Admiral Stephen Hackett, Alliance <gasps> HQ. Hackett! Commander Shepard, I need to discuss a sensitive matter with you privately. I'll take this in my quarters. enough of everything okay good to know thank you because I mean I've never played it before I don't I don't know if potentially I'm gonna be sabotaging myself I say sabotage I know there's no wrong way to play the game your scars start coming back you'll know you're being too bad commander thank you for your time I'll keep this brief we have a deep cover operative out in Batarian space names dr. Amanda Kenson Dr. Kenson recently reported that she found evidence of an imminent Reaper invasion. Hmm. So why call me? Just this morning I received word that the Batarians arrested her. They're holding her in a secret prison outpost on terrorism charges. I need you to infiltrate the prison and get her out of there. As a favor to me, I'm asking you to go in alone. Ooh, okay. Now you say alone, does it mean like alone alone or can I take some of my squad mates? Like just like not Normandy like full forces. It's probably just me, but let me just find out. What's Dr. Kenson actually doing out there? She's a deep cover operative, Shepard. That is true, first time we've seen we her. We talk only when we have to. I'd heard she was investigating a rumor of a Reaper artifact in the system. Her last report said she'd found it. What else can you tell me about the operative? Amanda 
as a top scientist and an alliance agent working in the Batarian space. It's a deadly assignment, and she's one of the few up to the challenge. She likes adventure. She and I go back pretty far, Commander. I won't let her run away in a Batarian torture camp. I thought the Alliance denies the Reaper threat. That must be some proof she found. Kenson's team found an artifact out in Batarian space. She believes it's a Reaper device, proof that the Reapers are indeed planning to invade. I've known her a long time. If she says she has proof, it's worth checking out. I have a hell of a squad with me. I'm sure they'd help out. Kenson is my friend. If the Batarians see a squad of armed soldiers, they'll kill her. This is serious, Commander. Go in with discretion, or don't go at all. Okay. The Batarians won't take kindly to the Alliance breaking into a secret prison. This is not an Alliance operation. Mm -hmm. It's one person going in alone to save a friend. If it were an official mission, of course the Batarians would be upset. You keep this quiet, Shepard, and there's nothing to worry about. I'll make this a priority. The prison is hidden underground and a Batarian outpost in Aratat. I'll upload the coordinates now. Once she's secure, confirm her discovery. We'll debrief you when you're back. Got it. Hack it out. All right, that's another mission on the docket. All right, so we've got a couple of missions we gotta work on here. Now it's a matter of which one we're doing first. But first, let me put these points to use. Cryo ammo and pull. There we go. I wasn't clicking it fast enough. Next heartbreak mission. Okay. So it's a biggie. Okay, so new arrival. Check out Aratod. Okay. We've got Project Firewalker, Rosalie Lost. Survey ship has gone missing near the planet Ziona. The ship was carrying researchers in a prototype planet-side exploration vehicle when it went missing. Cerberus has asked that the vehicle be recovered and that any signs as to the whereabouts of the researchers be reported. Oh, okay. Okay, so maybe I'll hold off on that one then. Only crash site. There are a couple of these other ones we still haven't done yet. The operative may have sensitive data that loss to Eclipse could cause irreparable damage to Cerberus. Okay, so we got missions and we've got assignments. Uh, you know what? I kind of want to do Zaids, just because I've had Zaids sitting here for a while. To Zoria. Faya Ismar Frontier. Okay, Zoria. Let's do Zaids. I haven't done this one. Hold up, hold up. We need to scan. Alright. A pressure cooker of a planet ventures thick nitrogen-based atmospheres also the source of wealth for a small colonist industry. How much paragon you Is that is that gonna is that gonna give me a bunch of renegade points? Is that what you're saying? While Venture's high temperatures are brutal, the primordial soup is not as acidic as on other hothouse planets, and Xenon can be readily collected and isolated from the lower troposphere by Recovery Boss. The Xenon is then sold for use in ion drives and some electric lights. Venture's gravity is relatively low for a planet of its size, making the, dis the recovery more economical than would otherwise be expected. Okay, we'll do scanning. I haven't committed to anything yet. Got a bit of a peek. Ooh, hello. Ooh, but we're full on iridium. Probe away. What else? Ooh, Ooh hello. Probe launched. Oh, 
launching probe. I mean, Zaid's mission is taking on the Blue Suns, right? Like, I'm already not exactly, uh, big fans of theirs. Ooh, hello. Probe launched. Probe. Rich. Alright, I'm not gonna get everything because I'm like full on iridium. Probe away. But let's see what we can get. Oops, I'm full. Yeah, I'm full. Alright. So let's focus on platinum. Which one women are how much? Oh, is there? Oh, okay. Because I saw like the the containers. So I assumed that meant uh, that I would hit my limit. But we can always give it a try. I mean, as long as the number keeps going up, we can keep collecting. Ooh, hello. Probe away. Oh, really? Alright. Alright, then we'll collect everything. Take it all. Alright, we're down to moderate. Poor. <laughs> I'm taking everything. Oh. Probe away. Okay. Mm. Oh, it's not that much. Ooh, hello. Probe away. I know I was avoiding iridium because we were full. <laughs> or I thought we were full. Oh. Let's Up depleted. And we're done. We've uh, destroyed this planet. RBL21, thank you so much for the follow. Hope you're having a good night. And let's go back and uh wait. Are there any more? Oh, where can I refuel? Oh, I need more probes. <gasps> oh, wait, hold up. Oh, there are so many unexplored ones here. Oh no. <sighs> okay, uh, and I only have five. Okay, here, let's check this one out. Watchmen. Perched on the outer edge of Iera's small solar system, Watchmen is a mid-sized rock and ice planet that has picked up a dozen moon-sized objects. Its nitrogen-oxygen atmosphere is too thin to support life, with solid ice covering its calcium-heavy rocky core. Footprints of the first surveying teams to come to the planet can still be seen on its practically airless surface. The planet, devoid of valuable resources, has seen few visitors since. Okay, oop, that's cold. Uh, moderate. Okay, not bad. Probe away. There we go. Only four left. Gotta make them count. Oop, hello. Oop, there we go. Launching probe. 
might have to come back here at some point to, to finish up. Ooh. Probe away. I've always got so much iridium. Okay, only two left. Probe launched. Alright, last one. Last probe. Because I can't restock here. Palladium. Can I get platinum? Ooh, that's double. You know what? We'll go for the double. Launching probe. A little bit of everything. All right. Gotta go. <laughs> All right. So what was that? You guys were saying that Zaid's mission is uh, very much a uh, blue sun or. Uh, Renegade geared one. Liberate a refinery from the Blue Suns. I mean, it's Blue Suns. They've been a big pain in the ass for most of the game. No, he's not a nice person. <laughs> you could argue that most of the people on my crew are not nice people. Some of them are. They're nice to me. Usually. Work there is done. He can dedicate his whole attention to the mission. Okay. You know what? Let's just do it. Yeah, Zoraya. Okay, let's do it properly now. <laughs> no more surveying. Let's go. Do you assert your authority? I mean, I gotta. Let's see. Help Zaid. I don't know, it's just I've had it sitting in my missions for a while now, and it's like, yeah, I should. Alright, I need probes. I need so many probes. There we go. Beautiful. Uh, we also got planets. Mm. <laughs> I promise we will get to Zaid's mission tonight. We're not gonna finish it, but we're gonna start it at least. A hydrogen helium gas giant, Metaponto, has developed a helium-3 fueling station funded by Elcor business interests who hope to bring enough attention to the system to attract terraforming investors and thus eventually develop Volturno as a habitable world. Thus far, they have met with little success. <laughs> oh. Ooh, it's poor. Launching probe. Oh, platinum. I need platinum. Now for the trauma module research project. No. Mm, that's not very much. Ooh, hello. Launching probe. just be getting upgrades in like literally every suit that the game offers me just to use up some of these resources. Okay. Well, no major jumps. Alright, yeah, let's move that around a little bit. Probe away. Probe. What else we got here? There's a fair amount here for 
for poor scanner results. There we go. Let's try to find a peek there. There we go. Depleted. All right, let's uh, let's buy some more probes. Okay. Let's see. Help Zaid. Here we go. This is a little out of the way, but. Means I can cross something off my list. Can't be all bad. Very quiet. Alright. Zoria. Mud, sweat, and spores is how Blue Sun's mercenaries characterize the planet that gave birth to their home office. This lush garden world is known for its heavy plant and fungal life, creating spectacular jungle zones over much of its eight continents. Despite persistent problems with rot and rust, Zoria attracts investors and corporations from all throughout the galaxy, since it has exploited only a fraction of its potential resources. The Blue Suns dominate security contracts on Zoria, so much that residents describe them less like a monopoly and more like a conquering regime. Well, I think that's a good excuse to get to work. Uh, well, Zaid, yes. Uh, who do we want with Zaid? Hmm, I imagine this is going to be a fighty one. You know what? Let's bring- uh, ooh. I'm like- oh, wait. Okay, I was like- Because I kind of want to bring Garrus, but I also kind of want to use some of the others as well. So I'm wondering if maybe tech might be a good thing to have along as well. Hmm. You know what? I haven't taken Jacob for a while. Let's take Jacob. He's got some good biotics powers we could use. Alright, uh, got a fair amount of points we gotta spend here. Let's see. Five points, three, and then two. Beautiful. Jacob, we got a lot of points for you, too. Uh, let's see. I've got seven, so we can do three and three. So let's do Cerberus Operative, and let's do Pull. There we go. Alright. And for me, I'm good. Mm. Arc Projector. Grenade Launcher. I mean, the Particle Beam was cool. No, let's go with the particle beam. Why not? Why not? I know I probably should have taken Garrus with me because of his history with the Blue Suns, but I want to mix up my teams a little bit. Uh, we're going where the fire is. Okay. Liberate the refinery. Tapping into Blue Sun's communications. Stay tight and look out for ambushes. Alright, let's see how we do. Oh, birds. Squad Bravo! A shuttle landed near your location. Check it out. Oh boy, here we go. <laughs> so it's of the same... Same thought process here. Ugh, here we go. Ooh, hello. Shot in the back and left to rot. That's definitely Vito style. Let's push ahead. All right, sounds good. What is that? Is that a Pokemon? What is that? Nope. 
this way. Yeah, here we go. What the heck is that? Hijack? Are, are you making that up or is that actually a thing? Commander Bravo, take a position. Likely these people are not runaways. I mean, I think it's cool. I don't want to shoot it. Oh, and there's more. That's the real name. Okay. Oh, hello. Is that meant to keep us on our toes? Like, uh, faking us out? No, okay. Krogan consider them vermin. Oh, but they're so cute. Oop, we got a save point. Report to base. Oh. Armed intruders incoming at the southern checkpoint. Oh, oh. Ah. Ah. Damn it. All right, we got a bunch over this way. Okay. No. Nope. All right, they're spreading out. Shepherd. Okay, uh, can I get some more ammo? We're doing good. We're doing good. Bridge controls. Okay. This is Commander Santiago. If any of you retreat while the intruders are still alive, I'll kill you myself. Now get the hell back out there. Vito. Sounds like he hasn't changed. I get the feeling you have a past with this, Vito. I knew he was a sadistic away. bastard back when we started the Blue Suns. The Suns only got meaner after he staged his little coup 20 years ago. So, yeah, we have a past. Interesting. Why didn't anyone tell me you founded the Blue Suns? Because it's not common knowledge. Vito wiped me out of the records. He ran the books, I led the men. Worked real well for a while. Then Vito decided to start hiring Batarians. Cheaper labor, he said. Goddamn terrorists, I said. Jeez, <laughs> Said. Buddy, come on. Twenty years is a long time to hold a grudge. A grudge? Vito I turned have a good my memory. man against me. He paid six of them to restrain me while he put a gun to my head and pulled the trigger. For 20 years, I've seen that bastard every time I closed my eyes, every time I sighted down on a target, every time I heard a gunshot. Don't you call that a goddamn grudge? Oh, boy. So, yes. How did you survive that? You survived a gunshot to the head? Yeah. And you survived your ship getting disintegrated. A stubborn enough person can survive just about anything. Yeah, but Rage I had is money a hell behind of an me. Anesthetic. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty extreme. I mean, that's why his scars are still there. Mine are healing because I'm a nice paragon person. We better get moving. <laughs> They're at the southern axis. All squads mass at the gatehouse. Now! That's true. Not my money. I know we're here. I had money. Not that much. Bring it on! Alright, 
I will take that. Well, we're gonna have a shootout here. It's never anything nice behind these doors. It's always just more problems. And a cutscene with problems. Zaid Masani, you finally tracked me down. Vito. Don't be stupid, Zaid. I have a whole company of bloodthirsty bastards behind me, ready to kill or be killed on my command. Actually, take your shot. Give my men a reason to put you down like the mad dog you are. Again. That gone nearsighted old friend. Burn you, son of a bitch. <laughs> you just signed your death warrant, Masani. I was gonna say, it sounds like John DiMaggio. I was trying to place the voice. I mean, this game's kind of got everybody. Wouldn't surprise me. Is that a Wilhelm scream? Opening the gate. We don't sacrifice lives for the sake of the mission. There's always a better way. It's like only okay when I do it. in the jungle for hours looking for another way in. You want to waste time out here? Go ahead. I'm going to kill Vito. You're endangering lives and the mission for your own selfish revenge. You really want to do this, Shepard? <gasps> I ought to knock you the hell out. Thanks to you, we have a burning refinery to save. Let these people burn. Vito dies, whatever the cost. Jeez. Okay. Uh, give him, give him a little bop to the head. Open fire! Oh, oh, What, John DiMaggio? Was John DiMaggio in Galaxy Quest? Oh, there he goes. Help! We're trapped! Oh. We can't get to the gas valve to shut them off! The whole place is gonna blow! No time. Vito's probably halfway to the shuttle docks by now. You're willing to watch these people die? Damn right I am. We stop to help these people and Vito gets away. And if he gets away, I'm blaming you. Ooh. No, Paragon, I'm sorry. We I'm sorry, Zaid. You're gonna hate me for this, but I'm sorry. We're here to free these people. We're going in. I knew this was a mistake. If we're gonna do this, we'd better get to it. Jacob's like, don't you do anything you're gonna regret. Probably. I, I figure it's probably gonna happen, no matter what direction we take with this. So. 17 Paragon points, let's go. Whoop. Uh, Richard Green. Okay, I'm trying to picture him. It's been a while since I've seen Galaxy Quest, but I have seen it. Whoa, okay. <laughs> All right, wish me luck. Let's see how we do here. <gasps> Crap. All right, all right, all right. Let's try it again. Okay. Get it together. Can't be failing this. 
He's not the one in Galaxy. Oh! Oh, my bad. Sorry. Huh. making rookie mistakes tonight. Let's give that a save. <laughs> it's getting dangerous. Whoa. Oh, did he play? Oh, okay. Okay. So he played the is it the villain? Oh, I'm gray makeup. Okay, that's that one. Oops, yep, gotta get that money. It's upstairs, okay. Oh, okay. Man, there's a lot of explosions. Ah! Okay. Up and around, up and around. I'm coming, I'm coming. I'm getting there. Oh, it's this. <laughs> not. It's not it. Alright, let's go, let's go. Stop, Vito. Everybody's getting out. Good, good. I just gotta get Vito. Ooh, hello. Don't mind if I do. Ooh, hello. Okay, gotta go this way. Ooh, hello. This should come in handy. Firestorm acquired. The following squad members are now able to use this weapon. It's a lot of VO work, nothing super notable. Okay. It's kind of like the, oh, hey, it's that guy of, of voiceover work. Ooh, this is like, I need a gun. Oh, fire. All right, maybe should I switch to something else for now? I've got it on standby. Ooh, we got enemies coming. Okay, there they are. Got him. Ooh, anti Krogan fortune. Okay. I mean, useful. But, oh, nothing else there? Okay. Just wasting time. Don't worry about it. I need to. Oh, was I not supposed to go that way? To face blood pack, grab the firestorm. Oh, okay. First person to bring me Masani's head gets something special in their paycheck. Oh, we got a lot of. Ooh, we got enemies here. Okay. Oh, he knows who I am. Okay. Alright, we got... Sons, I took your life. Now I'm taking it again. Alright. Okay. Okay, we got one more coming that way, and we got one. Never should have come here. Never should have come here. Ooh, we got two. And another one? Oh, we got quite a few there. Hold up. 
Hold up, hold up. Oh, we've got some on top of us, behind us. Alright. Alright, where's the spot to shoot it? Alright. Sit down! Okay, where's... I'm assuming there's a spot. Oh, there it is. Shoot it, shoot it down. Get over here. <laughs> okay. Uh, we still. Oop, we still got two over here. Um, let's go in the pole. Watch your aim. Firing. Okay, we still got. An impact shot. All right. Still got one over there. Oh, here we go. Okay. Ooh, we've got got some more company here. I need more ammo. Okay. Ooh, hello. Oh, there you are. Nice, okay. I need to heal here. Okay, what can we do here? Alright, everything's on cooldown. Oh, bust through armor. It's okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. We're good. Alright, we gotta... Nope. Wait, where are we? Oh, we gotta go this way. Yeah, same this way. Here we go. Alright, I'll take the credits. Um... Nothing else this way? No, had to go the other way. Which door? Wait. Uh, uh. Alright, hold on. Which door am I supposed to be going through here? Whoop. Probably move out of the way.
so close. Zaid. Uh... You just cost me 20 years of my life. Zaid, you all right? The hell do you care? I'm fine. But come on, get me out of this shithole. Ooh. Oh, boy. Um... You put your revenge ahead of the mission. How can I trust that you'll be there when we need you? I'll do what I was goddamn paid to do, Shepard. Just don't expect any more than that. Now stop screwing around. No Let's go. <laughs> you put your own goals ahead of the mission. That is not the way this works. I've survived this long watching my own back. No Shh. time to worry about anyone else. You're part of a team now, Zaid. There's no way we can do this unless we're all working together. You... You have a point. <laughs> I'm not done with Vito. But I can put that behind me long enough to get your mission done. Oh, I want to indulge in old man's revenge. Let's get the hell out of here. It's a lot of people. Did it. I didn't think we were going to finish this one tonight. Oh, wait, it's not over yet. We're not back on the ship. Did I pass the check? Didn't think we were gonna get to finish this tonight. Eldfell Ashland Refinery on Zoria has been liberated, though the company will have to spend millions to rebuild. Although Vito Santiago escaped, Zaid has accepted Shepard's command and appears focused on the mission. Zaid power unlocked. Inferno grenade. Nice. Got a new outfit for Zaid. Perfect. Love new outfits. Ooh, got the firestorm. Heavy weapon ammo, nice. And we got some credits. Having a paragon is a tough ch Is it really? Interesting, okay. All right. If you don't have enough paragon there, you lose his loyalty. If you do this before a costume's mission, some of the party goers will be gossiping about what happened here. <gasps> Interesting. Okay, all right. Well, there we go. I had the points for it. See, at first when you were mentioning the Paragon points, I'm like, are my Paragon points about to take a dive here? Is that what's is that what's happening? <laughs> is is the Zaid mission that uh, morally gray? And I mean, it was, but I got to do some good things, and I got uh, Zaid to come around. So, all in all, a pretty productive night, I would say. You can easily win his loyalty if you just get Vito instead. <sighs> yes. But that also means killing a bunch of innocent people. And I know that my shepherd has technically done that before, but I'd rather not keep up that trend, ideally. <laughs> In any case, thank you guys so much for joining me tonight. I honestly wasn't sure if we were going to get to finish Zaid's mission. I figured at least we were starting it. So that's... uh. Another thing to cross off the list there, so I hope you'll join me in the next stream. That's going to be Monday at 7.30. Twitter down below is going to have the details on that, and we'll have to figure out which loyalty mission we go on next. We've got quite a few to choose from, and, and please remind me, I gotta feed my fish. I'm worrying about human lives. I mean... <sighs> yeah, pin that post in the chat. <laughs> and recruitment that is true yes i would like to work towards recruitment so we'll figure out next week where we go i'd like to do at least one loyalty mission we'll see where it goes from there in any case guys once again thank you so much for joining me i hope you do recruitment first okay
I do still have some open slots on my squad mates. So yes, we will work on that. So that's going to be on Monday. Until then, guys, I hope you have a lovely rest of your week, a lovely weekend, and I'll see you on Monday for some more Mass Effect 2. Until then, guys, have a good one.